hey what's up everyone so before we hop into this video i just want to remind you guys to follow my twitch and my twitter i'm going to be streaming a lot more 2020 and i just want you guys to know that and by following my twitch and twitter you will get notifications of when i go live but let's hop into today's video welcome everybody i'm finally doing it we are here in minecraft and we are going to turn it into terraria just like i did with terraria but i turned it into minecraft now this video took a little bit longer to you know create because there's a lot more we can grab and use for this because Cause, you know there's not a lot of terraria mods that do minecraft stuff or even texture packs that turn terraria into minecraft and the opposite goes for minecraft there's actually a decent amount of terraria stuff some of them are like really old mods that might be removed and i might have to dig for i think there was a mod for the 1.6.4 version of minecraft and that's gonna take a little bit to find and you know we're just gonna start this off in segments okay we're gonna start off with resource packs then we're gonna go move to mods but let's go ahead let's hop into this we're gonna go through a couple of resource packs uh there's a lot of them but some of them aren't as good as these ones and also they're different versions but let's start with this one right here simply terraria it says it simply looks like terraria wow who would have thought all right here we go so the menu looks kind of weird it's all good it's still usable at least but yeah i don't even know what version of minecraft this is supposed to be for maybe like 1.10 i don't know but look at this we got these terraria textures in minecraft it's so weird it's so weird but at the same time it's so cool obviously what's minecraft regular regular uh texture pack size it's 16 by 16 i think i'm actually not sure on that but we look here at the terraria one a little bit bigger in the size i don't know the exact size maybe eight by eight four by four but uh you know i've always thought minecraft packs that have minecraft resource packs that have a uh, bigger sizes were always cool i know there's one that's like two by two and i always thought they look cool look like a completely different game but this is dope this is dope so let's explore a couple things that have changed look at a couple blocks here okay okay we got the flowers here we got another biome here look at this you can see that this is iron okay no it's not it's granite apparently uh we got dirt stone stone looks nice this is diorite andesite so this has to be fairly recent version if it has andesite diorite and granite uh we got the coal over here okay okay that's pretty accurate wait no why am i saying that's accurate there's no coal in terraria but i don't be staring that hard at a terraria block so maybe i won't know the exact look of them but the coolest thing i think are the trees there's a couple places we should check out there's a village over here let's check this out real quick and then we're gonna check out the nether and then we'll check out at the end and uh then we'll check out mobs and uh, items see what, what those look like because we're, we're trying to we're trying to speed through this we don't want to spend too much time on one thing but this looks nice this does look really nice let's see the chest nice you know exactly how i thought it would look and look at that these are diamonds okay didn't expect diamonds to look like that thought they would look like the gem in terraria but it's fine i guess we got the torches over here the crops aren't any different but the torches kind of ugly boom bada bing we're here in the nether honestly looks a little bit better looks a little bit better i hate the eye piercing red well i guess not yeah in 1.12 it's still eye piercing red nether rack isn't it it's not the updated nether rack this looks a lot better a lot more calm of a color you know we have the glowing mushrooms instead of the regular mushrooms i'm assuming the other color of mushroom yeah there it is it's just the regular mushroom and then glowstone purple interesting maybe it's supposed to be like amethyst i i don't know or maybe it's supposed to be like gem spark uh we got quartz in here which is straight up white okay that's honestly a lot easier to see the fire looks cool the lava don't know about the lava so instead of like checking out the end we'll just look at the blocks they look exactly the same who would have thought all right so let's go ahead let's look at some of the blocks like this if i see anything that really you know takes my attention we'll take a closer look at it but you know most of these they look exactly how you think they would look block of gold this looks pretty nice uh we got pumpkins but those look pretty cool too the uh red stained glass is it gem spark that's this is the only one that has a texture like that looking at all this other glass yeah like that's the only one that has a texture like that interesting redstone of course has been turned into wires which i've always seen both redstone and the wires from terraria as very similar things so you can see here some of these things have different textures bricks buckets have different textures let's see that in our hand nice looks cool uh gunpowder the same gunpowder texture as terraria and then the dyes are the dyes in terraria too bones same thing with that the uh, nether star is a star from terraria which is pretty dope i like that they did that because these look really cool and then we look at some of the food here ew what is the the sizing like what's up with the sprites on these ew did somebody forget how to size things <laughs> oh my god that is terrible i think my favorite by far is the raw rabbit the cooked rabbit and then the rabbit stew these are all pretty funny looking but now look at this we get into the tool section the diamond stuff is titanium which is pretty cool again somebody forgot how to size these things it's all good this one looks 
No, I was going to say it looked decent. It, it's pretty ugly. Like, I don't know what went wrong here. Next up, we got the bow. Uh, it doesn't look terrible. Again, same thing with the other sprites like this. It just it just looks ugly. Not the worst, but it still looks pretty ugly. Uh, we got the iron sword, wooden sword, stone sword, which is a custom texture and probably looks like one of the best. Uh, diamond sword, which is titanium sword. Kind of ugly. You know, you know the reason. And then the golden sword. Next up, we got the armor. I'm interested to see what this looks like. Is it just going to look the same when we put it on? Or is it, oh my god, it's actually a different texture. That's amazing. That is amazing. It doesn't look too bad at all. This is the gold one. Okay, not too bad i wish my character's eyes were a little bit lower maybe i, I gotta use a different skin where the eyes are lower because it looks like my nose holes are just making a face same thing with the iron not too bad they, they all kind of look the same now that i look at them it's all like the same idea but the titanium armor actually covers your face but it still has that little shoulder pad and then just like gloves instead of like covering your whole arm which is kind of weird that all of them have that but uh this looks pretty good and then we look here at the enchanted books and look at that it's like the the tomes in terraria the magic tomes all right now it's time to check out some of the mobs i have no idea what mobs have what let's try mushrooms uh, i think zombies are for sure pigmen we saw a pigman there was, there was nothing different wolf maybe no <laughs> zombie look at that for sure he's not burning okay uh but look at that that's what they look like the terrier zombies the mushroom i think might have some and what the heck it's not that ugly but at the same time it just looks weird all right i went through a bunch of the mobs apparently none of the other ones are different but let's move on to the next texture pack i have the the next texture resource pack on it's just it's just not working i look into it a little bit i don't want to spend too much time looking into it because you know there's a resource pack you just do the thing where you click the arrow and it comes over here requires optifine i have optifine i have all the you know what is it called the textures enabled custom stuff enabled uh, i don't know all right so apparently it is working it's just it's not a finished thing which i knew that already but i thought you know there would be some things in it if it's released to be downloaded it says it's like 35 percent complete so apparently you get to like rename a couple things with a name tag and then you go like this oh god let's see if i can hello <laughs> let's see if i can name one of them come on it's not that hard oh well, I renamed them, but it didn't really do much. It's just, <laughs> I'm not understanding this. All right, since I can't get it to work because of my thick, dumb skull, uh, you know, this is on planet Minecraft. You can look at everything. This is what the bat's supposed to look like. And they actually have a whole Google Doc where everything's pretty organized, you know, stuff that's planning to be added. And it seems pretty cool. It seems pretty cool. Like, look at this. this is Diamond Sword, if you put Fire Asperg on it, it's going to have a different sprite, which is really dope. I like when uh, resource packs add in a bunch of stuff. We got the bat right here. That's what it's supposed to look like this bat right here and that bat scroll down some more we got the rabbits these things i can i can barely see that one and uh there's the the horse the unicorn looks pretty dope i'll give it to them i kind of wish i can get this working but yeah that's pretty dope check it out this is cool hopefully once it's finished we can see the whole thing all right here we are in version 1.14 and uh we're using the also try terraria resource pack which seems to be the best so far this seems like this is complete and it's for a fairly recent version of minecraft and uh, the lava actually looks nice this looks like the other texture pack now that i think about it just updated but look at the horses they're all unicorns the cows ew what's going on with the udders i don't know what's going on in general oh is this supposed to be the minotaur oh that's cool that's supposed to be the mini minotaur okay look at this we got the mushrooms looking nice we got the trees these look like corruption trees yep they are uh let's look at the sheep here it might be a little dark ew what the hell is going on with your face <laughs> but every Everything looks good. Everything looks good. Dude, there is a fire happening over there. We got the uh, piggies over here and, of course, the ducks. Ew. These are pig rounds, aren't they? Ew. Yeah, I guess let's just go through all the mobs real quick before we go through a bunch of the blocks. Wow, this, this is kind of cool. This is kind of cool. I like this one the most so far. Uh, and if you're looking for a one to use, this might be the one. Look at the spawn eggs. The spawn eggs are stabs, slime stabs to be exact. And look at the bat that's beautiful that's what we like to see does it change at all no but yeah i guess let's just go through a bunch of these and see what they look like unless i already saw them i don't know if all of these are going to be different okay that's different for sure uh the blaze what is the blaze supposed to be let me see what is that Ew, what are you <laughs> what is this is this the imp this is something from hell i don't i i can't tell cats 
Okay, they look like cats. I don't know what I don't know what all is you gonna expect. Cods? What about even the cods? Are they? Yeah, they look like the best. They look like the best. This is 100% the best. The creepers are clowns. Oh my god, that's amazing. This is what some of y'all be looking like in the comments. <laughs> Version 1.14 of Minecraft. That's like that's like super recent. What is that? What could that possibly be that I'm looking at right now? Is this a llama? Ew, what is it? What in the fuck am I looking at? All right, let's take a look at some of this other stuff. Dolphin, oh, okay, yeah, it's got some Terraria dolphin vibes. There's no nose. Oh, it looks like a shark. Is that what it's supposed to look like? Okay, okay. Donkey, oh, it looks like the reindeer. That's dope. Drowned, look like the merman. Nice, I like that. Okay, let me get away from them. I don't like that noise they make. Oh my god, we got the Guardian. Oh my god, it's Duke Fisheron. This is amazing. Next up, we got the Enderman. Boom. Oh, it's the Chaos Elemental. Nice. Dude, what are these things supposed to be? These are disgusting. What are these? Endermite? What could an Endermite be? What is that? Is that Pinky? Bro, they thought of everything. Next up, Evoker. I think it's just a, it's a goblin, right? You look good. You look pretty damn ugly. <laughs> fox? I don't know what the fox is supposed to be. Is that a... Uh... Oh, is it the dog from the Halloween event? Next up, we got the ghast. This one might be a little bit loud. It's a Ayakatulu. I love this so much. I don't know how many times I'm going to say it, but I love it. You know, I'm starting to realize Minecraft has a lot of mobs because we still got so much more after like the last three groups I just did. Boom. Regular Guardians. This just looks like the uh, the fish that Duke Fish Ron spawned in. The Shark Rons, I think they're called. Next up, Husk. It's just a mummy. Nice. Can I see your face? Uh, Magnum Cube. Don't know what this is going to be. Oh, it's just a Lava Slam. Okay. Ocelot's just the regular version. I don't even know what the hell these things are supposed to be. Is there cats in the game? Is it cat pet? Mule Spawn Egg. Wait, we saw this one already. What the heck? The mule and the donkeys look the same. Okay. Uh, Panda. It's a turtle. <laughs> this is the best one. Oh my god, look at the turtle, it rolls, that makes so much sense. Parrots? I don't think the parrots matter that much. I don't know, is there parrots in the game? Yeah, there is parrots in the game. Is this what they look like in the game? I don't remember. <laughs> Next up, Phantom, I'm interested. It's a harpy? What? Okay, and then the Mushroom. This one better impress me. This better impress me. Oh my god, it's... it's... Can, I, can I see your face, please? Please. Alright, that's fucked up. Let me see your face. Oh my god, I don't know what's going on in the face area. Oh, is it a... It, uh, is it a moon? It's like a moonga fungus or something like that? Something like that. It's that like big bug, I think. Okay, let's see the pillagers. Ah, that's that's a perfect fit. And he's got the blowpipe or the dart gun. Wow, that's dope. That's really a very good attention to detail. Actually, I don't know. I don't, I don't remember if those dudes even... Don't they just use bows? Don't the archers just use bows? Whatever. It makes more sense that they have a dark gun because the way they'd have to hold it. Next up is the polar bear, which is just an ice version of the turtle. Wow. The mad lad really thought of everything, huh? Pufferfish? I, know, I don't know what a pufferfish is going to look like. Like, what, what, what mob is this? I don't know. <laughs> it's something. Oh, is this... The spike ball from uh, the solar eclipse? I don't know. Next up, rabbit. I mean, yeah, they look like the rabbit. I don't know what I expected. The ravager. Okay, this one could be very, very interesting. What are you? What is this? I see the, the three, three things on the side of your face there. There's some on the top of your face. All right, I dug deep through my mind and it's supposed to be a basilisk. I didn't go on uh, you know Google or anything. But yeah, this is a basilisk. You know, after seeing a couple more looks at it, yeah, I can see it. Next up, we got a salmon. I don't know, this is probably just gonna look like whatever else is in Terraria. I'm pretty sure salmons are in Terraria. Uh, next up, shulker. Very interested to see. Can I see what's inside? Open up, please. What is that? <laughs> Is it a chest? Is it a mimic? It's a, I think it's a mimic, isn't it? I don't know. That's what it looks like. It looks like there's teeth in there. Uh, silverfish. I have no idea what a silverfish is going to look like. Oh, is that just a, like a... What's it called? Something sea beetle or the husk? Whatever. It's, it's some sort of beetle that drops all the dying stuff. Next up, skeletons. Yes, 100%. That's what I expect them to look like. Now, if I were to guess here, without looking, the wither skeletons are going to be the blue armored skeletons. All right, skeleton horse. What else could it be besides a horse that's a skeleton? Wait a minute, while I was editing this, I noticed something. This is not just a regular skeleton horse. It's a sand skeleton horse. Look at the eye. Slime? 
honestly expected that the slimes were just gonna be slimes surprising that they're the blue ones though and not just the green ones uh next up the spider which i'm assuming was this the hard mode one or is this the pre-hard mode one i don't remember what the other one was we got the squid i think they're supposed to be like the jellyfish oh no this straight up squids in terraria too but none of the squids in terraria have a face oh yeah oh, there you go you can see its face sir let me sir let me see your face there you go you can, you can see it right there just little dots next up the stray i can't tell what you are is he the uh the ice people you know the annoying ice people that make the loud like glass breaking noises yeah that's what it looks like the trader llama i don't know what to expect i still don't know what these things are wait is this the two-eyed alien thing in the alien invasion what are those things called you can get it as a mount too that's disgusting tropical fish i think there's a clownfish in terraria I don't like the noise those make. Turtle. I think this one just this good one. This one looks like the pet, right? This is the pet turtle? Yeah. <laughs> I mean the other two turtles are already taken up, so. Next is the Vex. The Vex are pixies? Beautiful. You know, this part might be long, but like this this resource pack has stolen the show. This resource pack has just straight up just caught my attention. I love it the most. Let's check out this. What is this? Just villagers? Um are they all supposed to be party girls? Or is there a difference? Maybe I'm just summoning the same villagers. Yeah, what the heck? Are they all supposed to be party girls? Or were they all supposed to be different villagers? I don't know. Next up, we got the Vindicator. Okay, this is the dude that pulls out the hatchet, right? He's the, the orc warrior. Nice. Or the goblin warrior. Next up, Wandering Trader. The boy's on the run. It's the traveling merchant. Uh-oh. <laughs> Let's get a better look at him here. Yeah, that looks nice. Witch Spawn Egg. Which mob are you? Oh, is he a uh, Dr. Fly or whatever? Something like that? With the skeleton. Oh, he's just a regular skeleton. Dang, I thought he was going to be the armored skeleton, but still pretty cool. Next up, we got the wolves. Look at them. They're running really fast. Oh, they're trying to kill him. Okay. Damn, how big is their aggro? I'm just trying to get a look at them without them aggroing. They just take off running. All right. Well, there's the wolves. If you can catch a good glimpse at them before they run away. God, they're spitting? Y'all got beef? Next up, the zombie. Honestly, I don't know what else do we expect. Zombie horse. I have no idea what to expect. Oh, just like a dead version of the unicorn, I'm assuming. And pigmen. Let's see. Oh, it's the butcher. It's the butcher. I kind of wish this was a saw than the golden sword. Well, I guess they can't really make it a saw. They would have to make a golden sword because, you know, they obviously use the golden sword in the game and not like a custom weapon. And last but not least, the zombie villager. Uh, they look kind of funny looking. The blue. Yeah, sure. That's what they're supposed to look like. I'm still confused why the villagers are all party girls. <laughs> All right, just to speed this up a little bit, we're gonna just, you know, speed through these. Podzil is jungle grass, and then regular grass is obviously regular glass. But all of these are textured. Let's see uh, the glass when it's connected. Okay, yeah, it's kind of what I expected. But yeah, just quick, quick little breeze through these. They all look beautiful. Uh, dried kelp block. Looks like cactus. Now, what the hell does cactus look like? This looks like this. Okay, it just looks like a skinnier version. <laughs> Is a comparison next up we got the decorations take a good look at these these are beautiful the ladders are ropes that's amazing that is such a nice detail the jukebox is a music box and uh you know we got the anvil let's see what the anvil looks like oh my god they even legit like made its own sprite for everything you can still see the outline but that's still amazing iron bars let's see what these look like oh god these are uh, pretty thick but there you go the crates uh, the shulker boxes are crates that's amazing that is really really cool the, you can see the effort put into all this the details the effort all the knowledge and i appreciate that a lot but there you go one last scroll through all of this you guys can see everything uh let's let's check the mannequin oh there's the ender dragon too i guess we should check out the wither and the ender dragon but there you go there's the ender dragon it's the wyvern he looks kind of funny looking and uh the armor stand looks the same just a little bit of looks like a cardboard texture next up we got the redstone stuff the lever obviously being the lever from terraria 2 oh my god that is so dope <laughs> the lectern they even got the lectern they got the dropper the observer of course this is like the the flame trap and then the dropper is obviously the spike ball trap i'm assuming the lectern where's that supposed to be is this supposed to be like the be bewitching table oh it is okay next up we got transportation right here the elytra beautiful 100 this is what i expected from the elytra is the uh 
just a wing set of some sort look at this the boats we gotta see the boats we have to see the boats come on yeah we gotta see the minecart too there's just so many things to look at so many things to look at and i want to i want to check all of them out in a good you know time frame and not just take forever but this is amazing uh let's check out all the boats here boom oak boat beautiful birch boat uh looks kind of burnt for a birch boat and then everything else looks nice now we get here to the miscellaneous stuff you can see a bunch of beauties here i'm not gonna look oh this is an ender pearl what okay it looks kind of weird now that i think about it how did i get stuck right here the eye of ender is a uh sigil to spawn in the moon lord nice we saw all the spawn stabs and then the the music disc are like the music boxes which is awesome check out all the food right here quick look at this all looks beautiful of course now the tools let's let's take a look, closer look at the tools boom we got this looks nice looks a lot the textures are actually you know sized perfectly unlike that other texture pack we were looking at uh mainly let's just look at this oh so it's weird that the hoes are sized because there is a scythe in the game only one of them though but it's still cool that they he went with that idea for the hose uh check out these the demonized stuff and then we got the fishing rod looks great and then we got the shears looks great too now i'm wondering if like if i put a certain enchantment say on the fishing pole does it change texture because i know a lot of people started doing that recently with minecraft resource packs and i appreciate that a lot because it's really cool okay so this i put up enchantment on the fishing pole it looks exactly the same but yeah let's, let's do the enchanted books obviously are that the lead is a rope name tag is a speech bubble and then we get to the weapons what everyone's just been waiting for boom okay there's no arrow there oh there you go now it's there looks great we got the swords here just check out all of them at the same time boom 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 bang you know i had to change it up at the end oh look at that the xp is actually like coins and this is the pork chop it looks kind of nasty but yeah i'm interested to see what armors they have here starting with leather so they have what is this the ninja set for the leather stuff very interesting they use the sprite for those boots uh, I don't know the sprite just feels big, but it still looks good. But look at that It's the ninja armor set for leather and I'm assuming you can dye this um, next up We have okay. So yeah, this does make sense. I guess it's just they all have an upgraded version of boots So next is the chainmail set not the iron So we'll do the chainmail one which the boots are the was that the rocket boots, which is dope looks great next up we got iron and uh what is this specter boots here's the gold set with the uh lightning boots ew you can see my eyes like a little piece of my eyes that looks disgusting and then last but not least the frost spark boots with the demonite armor i do think i'd prefer like solar armor even though you know they are trying to keep it fairly close together in terms of like upgrading i i prefer a solar armor set or some sort of post moon lord set maybe you know if he adds in stuff for like when you enchant stuff and it changes its look when it has an enchantment you know that could work too depending what enchantments you have say you have fire protection you get like the nebula set or you get the not the nebula set the solar set and then if you have regular protection you get the other set i don't know of course all the arrows have colors the shield totem of undying is a uh voodoo doll of the guide sweet the shield looks as beautiful as it can it's the uh, cobalt shield the trident of course the trident who can forget the trident let's give that a nice yeet over there oh good dodge or i just have bad aim oh no and next up we got the crossbow which of course is a dart gun beautiful even the achievements we're getting are these these are terraria achievements i don't know <laughs> Uh, here's a look at the potions beautiful how many times have i said beautiful i don't know but there you go we pretty much went through everything and 100 percent it seems like this is the greatest texture pack so far i loved it for version 1.14 shout out the creators of all of these texture packs but now it's time for me to start digging and looking for some mods some older terraria mods let's see if i can find it uh well older and recent ones i guess and uh real quick since i said i wanted to look at it let's look at the wither let's see what the wither looks like uh, just because we can pretty much see what the ender dragon looks like here i could summon him in too if we want to see what he fully looks like i'm assuming he's just gonna be a white dragon that's it but let's see the wither he is the wall of flesh that's that's pretty dope all right let's summon an ender dragon it might get a little bit louder yeah he's exactly what i expected a little bit skinnier, a little bit derpier. I don't know why he's doing circles. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I had to split this up into two parts, you know, resource packs and mods because the video was just been too long and it's already pretty long. And then judging by YouTube's analytics, I think a bunch of people aren't going to make it past the three minute mark without getting bored. But yeah, I'm going to say it again. Please follow my Twitch and Twitter so I no longer have to post a video on YouTube about when I go live on Twitch because that messes up with the ranking and algorithm system on YouTube when it comes to my side. 
notified because I usually post a video and then I delete that Twitter video. I don't leave it live anymore. And I also want to be able to, you know, stream the same day when I post some videos. But yeah, thank you guys again for watching. Shout out all the resource pack creators and mod creators for all these Terraria mods and stuff. And I will see y'all in part two.